We're at three miles in the run right now. We're wrapping up our easy pace recovery run for the day. Nothing like the Texas heat. Remember, if you're a new runner, it's really important to get a nice little warm up before your runs. Even if it's just squatting a couple times, getting in some lunges, getting in some quick little hops, you wanna get some blood flow before you just get in the run. So many times when you're just getting into running, people just wanna get it over with. So they end up just putting their shoes on and heading out. But a lot of times that leads to injuries and it leads to you not performing your best on your run. So just keep that in mind. If you guys are just starting out, get a freaking warm up in, even if it's really quick. If you do nothing else, do little hops with each foot and I promise you'll feel better for your run. <laughs> We're flying dog! Let's go! Just got back from a morning run. Today I'm reviewing the Nike Pegasus 40s, but I need to go shower first. What's happening guys? Welcome back to another video. And today we have a freaking shoe review. I've not done a shoe review in a very long time. So I'm excited to bring you guys this one because Nike just sent me the brand new Pegasus 40. This is 40 years in the making. Let's get into it. What makes this shoe so iconic? As you guys can hear, this is Nike's 40th iteration of the Pegasus shoe. This shoe first started in 1983, and when it first got released, it was really designed to be durable, but also an affordable running shoe option so that people could get involved in this sport. When you're first getting into running, there's a lot of barriers. First off, it's the mental block of even doing the activity, but then from there, Everyone wants to know what shoe can I get so I could perform the best or what shoe looks the most stylish. And the Nike Pegasus has been one that's been around for a very long time. 40 years later, they've made a lot of changes in this shoe, but they've still kept its affordability and its durability. This has become one of my personal favorite daily trainers because regardless of where I'm at in the world or depending on what I'm training for, this is something that can take me on long runs, easy pace runs, recovery runs, speed workouts, whether it's an interval workout or a track workout. And the fact that it's that versatile, it becomes a really good daily training running option because you don't have to have 18 pairs of shoes. If you're just starting out on your running journey, you wanna find a shoe that can be versatile in its use case. You don't wanna have something that's just designed for racing marathons or just designed to run on the track. And that's why the Nike Pegasus is a popular option. Now let's see what sets this version apart from its predecessors. One of the key updates is the new Flyknit Upper, which provides a snug and sock-like fit. It's breathable, lightweight, and adapts to your foot's movement, which gives you that locked-in feel without sacrificing comfort. Now to the midsole. Nike's incorporated their renowned Zoom Air technology in their midsole. It has the perfect amount of push-off when you're on your runs, whether that's a long run or if you're going for a speed workout. Now onto the outsole. The Pegasus 40 has been redesigned with a durable rubber and a waffle pattern. This combination ensures excellent traction on various surfaces, whether you're running on the road or hitting the trails. I have a ton of different running shoe options and this one has been a staple in my rotation because of how versatile and durable it is. When you're traveling with a suitcase, you can't bring that many pairs of shoes with you. So you wanna find a shoe that can be versatile regardless of what your trip might entail. And that's why the Pegasus 40 has been a big staple in my running shoe rotation. As someone that has a ton of different options for shoes, the Pegasus line has always been a staple because of its versatility and its durability. I travel a ton for work, and when you travel, you can't pack that many shoes in a suitcase. So I like having shoes that have the ability to go hike a mountain or to go run the streets of a major city. And that's exactly what the Pegasus can do. With so many different shoes on the market, you have to find one that fits your lifestyle. And if you're just a beginner starting your running journey, this is a really good option that'll be versatile and affordable. And that's a wrap, people. That's the Nike Pegasus 40 shoe review. I hope you guys got some value out of it. Whether you're a beginner runner or a seasoned runner, this is a really good shoe to have in your rotation. If you guys like this style of video or maybe just the reviews just in general, drop in the comments what shoe you wanna see us review next. Until next time, we'll see y'all in the next one. Deuces!